friends welcome back today we will check how we can uh, provide access to the iam user uh, to the eks cluster so in this example so i have created a demo user uh, he is an administrator but uh, um, okay we'll uh, we'll go to the eks cluster i have an eks cluster I have created the eks cluster through the console itself uh, and this eks cluster has some uh, node group associated and uh, uh, nodes are associated I can see the node detail, but uh, I can't see the uh, sorry node group details, but I can't see the node detail. So, uh, how how can we provide uh, access to that particular demo user? Earlier, uh, we have to make update on the uh, auth.config file in order to give up, uh, access for any user to the Kubernetes cluster and even seeing the details on the uh, nodes in the UI. But uh, they made this process much more easier and we can add this through ui itself so let's log in as a, a, a user who is having access to the uh, eks cluster so i have logged in as an administrator here and uh, i am going to the eks cluster and go to the access here uh, you have to configure the access configuration so either it can be uh, eks api uh, or uh, config map or eks api and config map so better to choose eks api and config map so we have flexibility on both the ways uh, now comes to the create access entry select the iam user so our username is demo.user and uh, select the type of standard because this is a user if there is uh, roles uh, Kind of thing then we need to select the linux or windows but in this case it is uh, it's uh, uh, standard and the username is optional because we are adding an iam user the username will take it from the iam itself and uh, here we are not adding any group and let's go to the next here we need to select there are four different policies given by aws uh, we don't have direct access to view or uh, edit these policies but uh, uh, this administrative policies will give complete access to the uh, user so select this and if you if you are if you are adding to the complete cluster select the cluster if you are giving to a specific namespace you can uh, select kubernetes namespace and add the namespace here i'm going to give to the complete cluster so i'm adding one more and then add next And create so once you have created just review that once come to access see that uh, user is added yes it is been added now log out and login as that uh, user have logged as demo user now let's go to the eks cluster demo user sorry eks cluster and uh, come to the access so you can see the access details here and come to the compute you can see the instance details as well so this was missing earlier and now been added so the same mechanism can be now he will be having access to through the eks etl as well uh, so you can try that as well thank you for watching have a great day